New at five, controversy leads to conversation. Tonight we are hearing from the mother and daughter who were disturbed by a school assignment on sex abuse. The worksheet has since been pulled from Bradford High School. Mary Jo Ola reports from Kenosha. A Bradford High School sophomore tells me as soon as she read the first question on this assignment, she knew something didn't feel right. The first question on our sheet was what could Melissa have done differently to have avoided her sexual assault? The assignment was part of a class on mental health and sex abuse. Like what could she have done to avoid her sexual assault? She didn't do anything. So it was shocking for us to like we didn't really know how to respond. Haven Eigenberger is a sophomore at Bradford High School. She says she and her classmates didn't say anything at first because they didn't think anything would be done. Eigenberger held off on doing the work and brought it up with her mom. So I was disappointed when I initially saw the question because it goes at it in the wrong way and it can actually trigger or re-traumatize somebody who's been through it. Charity Eigenberger shared the worksheet on Facebook Wednesday night. It has since been shared more than 11,000 times. She says Bradford's principal called her the next morning. Like Haven said, there is no excuses. He just said, you know, I'm sorry, kids shouldn't have had to face that question. Kenosha Unified School District says the assignment has been removed and they are reviewing their health curriculum. But I was really pleased with how seriously Dr. Sinclair took it and that he dealt with it right away. Mary Joola, today's TMJ4.